some favorites. One of the things that I love about the ukulele is that um, it's very simple to play. You know, when, when pe if someone has never played an instrument before, yeah. as you know, you can learn songs in just a couple minutes, right? Yeah. So, and in fact, I'll demonstrate that uh, for that. our viewers. So one of the first chords that I learned as, an, as a child was a C major chord, which okay. looks like this. And you just take one finger and you do this, right? And then one of my favorite chords is the A minor or the A minor seven chord, and it looks like this. <gasps> no oh, hands, right? That's a beauty. Very and then little the, wear and tear. And the third chord that I'm going to teach you is, yes. a, is the F chord, okay, okay, or an F add nine chord. And all you're going to do is put your finger right there on the second string, the first fret. Just like that. Very pretty. And then you go back to the A minor chord. And you can play songs like this. I got this feeling inside my bones. It goes electric, baby, when I turn it on All through the city, all through the zone It goes electric, baby, when I turn it on I can't remember the words, okay. but Would but it's just very you, simple like that. And you, you know, kids can play it. Any anyone who uh, who's even who's never touched an instrument before, they can play the ukulele. Yeah. You know, you talk about playing an ukulele. But this is your job, isn't it? So is it, are you telling me that it's your job to play every day? Traveling, you know, sure. traveling can be very, you know, can be physically tiring and even yes. mentally tiring. But once I get to play on stage, yeah. for me, that's play. And that's right. the reason, you know, that's what I love doing. That's my passion. I always tell, especially kids, you know, that they should, they should study hard in school and try different things and find something that they love doing. You know, find yep. something that they're passionate about. Because when I was a child, no one uh, forced me to practice. You know, I just played all the time. I just, and, and if it's something that you love doing, you're going to do it anyway, right? Yeah. Whether someone tells you to do it or not. In fact, my parents would have to take the ukulele away from me so <laughs> that I would do the other things that I'm supposed to do, like my chores yeah. and eat my dinner and do my homework and go to bed. Did you take that ukulele to bed and play it under the cover sometimes? I did. I bet mm -hmm. you did. Yes. It sounds like it. Sometimes I would be practicing in my room, and there were there have been many times where I'd be lying down on my bed and practicing a song, and I would actually fall asleep. And when I wake up the next morning, the ukulele is still on my on my <laughs> really? chest. Yep. Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness. You know, and I also tell people yeah. that the most important thing, you know, once you find something that you're passionate about, is be drug free. You know, I have been drug free my entire life, and you don't need drugs. Well, you are a beautiful guy. You are a beautiful guy, and we, it shows through and through. And we can hear it in your music, too. I love uh, bringing joy to people. Well, you clearly do that, and I have to say, as an instrument myself, you are a wonderful ambassador for us ukuleles. Oh, and I want to no. thank you. You well, do, just keep up the good work, okay, buddy? Well, thank you very much, and it was a pleasure to meet you. Uh, and you know, if I had a hand, I'd shake yours. <laughs> it's okay. Yeah, sure. The family tree is mahogany. Ukulele Alley is the place to be.